after it has been around mostly unchanged for pretty much a decade, the all-new version of the Expedition was finally revealed a couple of months back. It looks like the new model will hit the market as a 2018 MUT. Even though it may be quite early to say much about a future update, it looks like there are already plans for the 2019 Ford Expedition. So far the details are still scarce but it looks like this new model would include a few missing features. On top of that, the 2019 revision of the Expedition might also see the introduction of a few new trim levels in order to allow it to compete with its competitors from GM. Just like with the new version, the 2019 model of the Expedition will still be based on the same chassis as the F-150 truck. This means that it will use a fully boxed-in frame together with a fully independent suspension setup. On top of that, unlike its predecessor, the car is going to use an all-aluminum body which will assure the car will remain as lightweight as possible. The regular models of the 2019 Ford Expedition are going to look roughly the same as the 2018 car. Expect them to possibly receive new LED headlights and tail lights but that should be it. The new trim levels, on the other hand, might change a bit more than that. For starters, it looks like there is a chance for Ford to release a new luxury edition of the Expedition called the Vinyl. So far this has yet to be confirmed and it looks it may not even be available on the US market. This model would include a new grille design, more chrome inserts as well as bigger wheels. It is also expected to come with unique paint schemes and possibly an air ride system which would allow the SUV to get lower at highway speeds in order to save fuel. Most rumors are saying this model might become available only in select markets such as China or the Middle East. However, Ford may also surprise us and release it on the US market as well. Unsurprisingly enough, the 2019 Ford Expedition is not going to be all that different from the current model which is also basically identical to the F-150 truck.